Pete said this morning that he wasn't impatient with the scoring drought that you were having. Were you impatient, and how good does it feel to get the hat trick? Yeah, I mean, definitely when you want to score goals. I know someone, uh, I don't know, asked me maybe this morning or whatever, saying, does it feel like it's it's been a while and, you know, you're still contributing, but obviously when you want to help the team win, you want to score goals. Um, and definitely I think scoring, you know, one gives you confidence, gives you ready to go. And, kind of just uh, like a domino effect. We'll go back right to Ryan. Rupe, it's a couple games in a row, and I know you weren't in the first one, but where there's a real flip in the second period. What did you see tonight? How did you guys flip the flow of play as dramatically as you did, do you think? Yeah, I think we, we just started to win battles and uh, and uh, just try to get the box, box below their goal line because I think we were, we've were we been losing the box in the neutral zone, and then they've been going back back and forth so I think we got to start the next game a little bit like having the, the mindset to win all the battles and, and uh, start, start winning every race. We'll go back right to Mark. Jason, what is it about this team that you guys just seem so unflappable? I mean that's about as tough a first period as you can have and you guys didn't seem to be worried about it at all. Yeah, well I think I mean honestly we, we know we're here for a reason. Uh, we know we're a great hockey team, and we know if we do what we need to be done, and everyone does their job, and I mean, trust trust the systems, it's going to be successful. So, um, I mean, I think that's the great thing with our team is no one steps out of it, no one's trying to do too much, forcing plays, trying to cheat the game, even when you're down by a couple goals, um, and then guys just keep sticking with it, stick with it, and. Um, I mean, it's contagious when everyone's, when one line's going, another line's going, it's just, you can all build through it. Third row on the right, Josh. Uh, Jason, it's not easy to talk about, you know, someone who's right beside you, but what did uh, the guy beside you bring tonight? What did, he, what, did, what did he bring to your line as well? Yeah, well, I mean, obviously you could see the speed really drive our line um, due to neutral zone. I mean, he was first on pucks in the, in the, on the four check, so... I mean, that's uh, like he said, it was a race and he won, you know, almost all of them, if not all of them. So, um, yeah, it was it was a great I mean, it was a great game for him to come back in. I know it's not easy coming in, having a week or two off, but uh, I mean, he didn't look like he missed a beat. And uh, not even just that. I mean, he just, you know, had a great game. We'll go uh, on the right to uh, Andrew. Rope, on, on your side, how long did it take for you to feel like you were at, at full speed and how good was it to feel you were right in the mix of things when the comeback happened in the second? Yeah, I, well, I wasn't that long out, and uh, I was I was skating almost every day, so uh, I get the, get the speed, uh, have the speed there, and, and my my legs and lungs. So, of course, it's it's fast, fast and heavy game, but uh, and we didn't have the best first period. So, uh, but, uh, but it was great to see that we came back in the second and, and started winning battles. So then then it was melt. Second row left, Mike. Hey, Jason. Uh, Sagan called your uh, third goal the most robo goal of all time. <laughs> Just that's what you do. And, you know, he said it's not fluky, it's things you think about. One, what did you think about? And two, did you have to get the confidence of the first two goals to even try that? Yeah, I mean, um, we're working on a lot of stuff. I mean, with our goalie coach, with Wedgie, you know, Jakey in practice, um, trying to find ways to score goals. Um, it's hard. I mean, goalies are too good in this league, so if you can try to find something that might work, um, I will say that probably having those couple goals before, I mean, gave you that confidence, just try it, you know, see what happens. Um, I know Rupa's wide open, he said, um, but uh, yeah, I mean, when you have that confidence, like I said earlier, things just happen, so um, yeah, it was a big goal for us. Center right, Sean. I know from talking to the other guys that not a lot was said rah-rah period, but it, it wasn't just one guy or two guys getting things going. It kind of seemed like the whole team just came out and completely flipped the switch. How do you account for that happening, that the whole team just kind of all of a sudden wakes up and goes? Yeah, I think uh, I think it starts with one line. Um, it's one line goes. I, I, like, I, like, like I said, I like the word contagious. One line goes, another guy on the line sees that. They see them doing the right thing, winning battles, putting the puck in a good spot, not turning the puck over. That line sees it, then the next line sees it, and the next line sees it, and um, we're, you know, we're such a good, I mean, good team, well-coached team. Everyone follows their systems, and um, that's how we kind of build our success. So, 
I think it's just a culmination of all our lines doing the right thing. Um, like I said, putting their ego side, just playing the right way, and um, we just build off of it and you know create our own momentum.